Okay, guys, before we start this reaction, we come in peace. We choose peace. We are choosing peace. Let's try not to argue on this one. The conflict might be still going on, guys. It hasn't been as heated and on our side of the world. Like, it's definitely died down on what our side mean? of the world. What you mean? Like, I the haven't co seen media coverage the media for it. hasn't really been Bro, pushing Bro, y'all just that. didn't see in the White House, they, they had to call the police. They, was like, yeah, they had to put up, like, a oh, fence yeah, well, and all that. Yeah, the protesters didn't. are still out, for sure. That. You did? No. Yeah, yeah the protesters are still out. crazy right now, But our president said he was going to try to do Something, you know, our stupid president said he was gonna try to get someone over there and uh make it like ceasefire. I guess didn't he say that? Didn't they just bomb Yemen? I think he did something along the lines of that. Where that is over there, uh, I don't that's know. That's right. Like, I thought that was like, well, I, I know it's in the Middle East, but oh, it, yeah, that is crazy. Yemen. I didn't even think about that. Yeah, they just bombed Yemen. That is crazy. Is that like by Lebanon? Yeah, it is. It's in that, it's in the Middle East, I believe. The United States bombed Yemen. Yes, yeah. it's right there. It's the first Wait, one. Wait, what for what? That was, that's what we're about to see. You need know that? No. That's why people try to say World War III is happening right now. Joe Biden is the worst president of all time. It says... 25 attacks on international shipping in the Red Sea by Houthi rebels Yemen. in Yemen in the last two months. The U.S. and British militaries attacked around 60 Houthi targets. Houthi. They had support from Australia, Canada, Netherlands. So a bunch of countries went after them. What is Houthi? Hmm. Some sort of group. Yeah. yeah. I'm pretty sure I saw where Joe Biden said they're terrorists, and he's the one who removed their terrorist status. Joe Biden. What made them terrorists, though? They just say what the group did. That they said they were robbing international trade boats. So they're just pirates. 25 in the last two months. So they're pirates, pretty much. I'm the captain yeah, We can now. look up more information Man, you on know what's that. crazy? Because i seen a video. Did y'all see that video? Y'all probably didn't. It was on Twitter. It was actually funny. It was like people were on a cruise and one of them little boats like off of Captain Phillips was next to it and everybody was freaking out. <laughs> like you hear people shrieking in the background but he was just selling watermelons. And he I'm was pretty sure they got the security dude, on the boats dude, now, Yeah, the dude was like, he was joking because he had a little microphone. He's like, I'm the captain now. <laughs> <laughs> the dude on the other boat? Yeah, on the other oh, boat. Was he knew up. why they were scared. Oh, that was but it was obviously like he does this like, it was, was so funny. Was, I was hilarious. crying when I see that. Basim Yusuf. Oh, yeah, man. The this is about to get... Uh, I like Basim. Basim. Let's go get heated. I actually think you're a smart guy. I actually think you know your stuff. You're just so fixated that Israel's the problem. The problem in the Middle East, like I said, follow the money. The countries that are succeeding, the Qataris, even the Saudis these days, they're coming into the modern world. They're leaving the, the sixth century mentality behind and say, let's get into the 21st century, where, where they need to succeed... In, whether it's Gaza or whether it's Lebanon or whether it's Syria and whether Afghanistan, they need to focus on GDP, not GDT. Gross domestic product, not gross domestic terrorism. And the problem is they're obsessed. Put the guns down. Put the Quran down. Actually start living by the words that the Quran says, not some false uh, equivalent of what they think is actually going on there. You talk about the genocide in Israel or in Gaza, as if it's just a matter of fact. Well, let me, let, me, let me show some stats for you because after you see these stats, Israel's the worst genociders ever. The numbers, the, according to the world data, if you trust data, between 1990 and 2022, the Palestinian population overall went from 2 million to 5 million, okay? Pretty bad at genocide if that's what's happening right there. In Gaza, it went from 645,000 to 2.1 million. It's 3X. That ain't genocide to me. Now, do 20,000 people, 30,000 people needlessly killed during this bullshit war that was started by Hamas? Is that horrible? One million percent. And any Jew or any Israeli... Give me that number said, again. 600,000 to what? 645,000 to 2.1 million. From what to, from one, from one to where? This is in 1990 to 2022. Do you know Pull why they increased? Because they're having babies like crazy. No. You see, this is how in how how like when you watch that mm -hmm. uh, while being uninformed makes me look makes you look very stupid. Tell me why. Tell the me how reason, the tell me how the, the population has the gone from two million to five million. Yeah, because most of the one point five extra million didn't come from Gaza. They were pushed away from other parts of Israel. So most of these people they have increased because of refugees no, being kicked if out. If you're talking about the settlers, those are tens of thousands. I'm Stop talking it. about those Gaza. aren't millions of people. Dude, dude, dude listen. Mo my wife's family is not from Gaza, and yet they found themselves in Gaza because they were sitting in other uh, other cities and villages outside Gaza. This is the systemic pushing of people from other parts of Israel, yeah. pushing them that's to Gaza. That's not millions of people. This is why I said that you're intellectually million. dishonest no, or intellectually no, lazy. No, That's not the cause of millions of people I'm, being I'm, moved. I'm, I'm, so, I'm familiar with the know? settler no, stuff no, this and is, the disengagement you don't know in 2006. It, you don't know what you're talking about. It's, no, These are people that are outside. Millions of people? What? Okay. 
The people who belong to Gaza are 700,000 people. Right now, Gaza is 2.2 million. That is not birth rate, my friend. Mm -hmm. These are people pushed from, and by the way, that's not the first time. 1948, uh, at the night of the declaration of the state of Israel, 1.5 million, 1.5 million Palestinians mm -hmm. were like moved overnight. So it's not the first okay. thing. So before you tell giving me numbers to you want to appear sure. smart, know what are behind the numbers because these are not people that give in babies. Okay. These are people being pushed from other places in order to be part of the open air prison that it is. Okay. So then, so it then, is not, then it's, so it's not then If it's you want to fact check me, let me fact check you. Mm. Anytime that there's numbers increasing, Basif, going from 650, 450, whatever you want to call it, to 2 million, however it happens, that's the exact opposite of a genocide. So the whole genocide, the whole open air prison it's are my talking friend. points. This are talking points of BS. No, and this is why I said you were intellectually lazy no, no, or no. you just hate Bas Israel. Basically you just you just this whole thing about you hate Israel and hate Islam, this is a very lazy way to talk to people. It's kinda you know, like it's, your it, kinda like your thing. What what did I tell you that is so lazy? What did I tell you like you're fucking racist? Because I'm you've already said that multiple times. No, I times. didn't say yeah, I you said, did, I you said, said that are, multiple times. I said times. your undertone is racist. No, okay. that's not what so not not me, two, but what's going on inside of me? And someone like you, the way that you analyze numbers is very lazy because again, really, these when I actually use stats and data from, let from me hear the most credible sources, that's lazy. These we'll are up. numbers that were outside you've of Gaza. You've said no stats. It, it, you've it, given it, fucking it, opinions like the whole time. It's like California has increased triple, or the size of uh, like te people in Texas increased because of birth rate. No, they increased because people from California started moving voluntarily. You have pushed 1.5 million people outside of Gaza, inside of Gaza in a matter of 12 years. And that's why the number has inflated. Mm -hmm. It's not because they were giving birth rate. So then, they where, were, then they where's were pushed, the genocide? They were, they were evacuated. Where's this alleged genocide that's happening? That's happening right now under okay. your eyes. So as of as of three months ago, there was no genocide. So it's just a new Well, thing. we didn't actually use the word genocide before three months ago. Okay, but you've we been calling for it. the river for the we sea didn't use it. for decades. So well, well. Also, also, Israel have a lot of maps that is putting in the greater Israel from the Nile and the Euphrates. That's that genocide for five countries there. And this is not by people in the street or people on YouTube. These are ministers. These are officials in the official government of Netanyahu. If you have someone, a, a, an, an Arab president, like the Egyptian president or the Jordanian king, tell you from the river and the sea, it's like, oh, it's the Arab authorities. You are basically complaining people on Facebook and the official. Uh, viewpoint of the Israeli government. You're basically comparing apples to oranges. It doesn't make any sense. Mm -hmm. You're basically comparing activists with people with power, with money, and with weapons. So I don't know how come you're comparing So them. what's your solution? Because you got all these answers and we have no solutions. What's your solution? Justice. Stop okay. killing people and, okay. and give them back their land. That's it. Okay. And, and, and giving them back the land, that is going to be a much more complicated thing. Who's going to lead your negotiations? Mahmoud Abbas, 88 years old? I have no idea, man. No, no. I have no idea. You, that's the I point is no you idea. don't have an idea. Well, I'm, 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 when I say I have no idea, I'm being humble because there's a million people who can do it. But like, I'm not a politician. I'm a comedian. I come here to tell some of my opinions. But the thing is, you want to put me mm -hmm. and, and then you use that and you give me, I'm sorry to say, butchered political information, a number yeah. that doesn't Stats say anything. Stats are really butchered in political Yeah, yeah. But, but it's I, interesting how you have all the solutions for Israel, but you have no solutions for Gaza or Hamas. Very interesting. Very okay. interesting how you can critique everything that's going on in Israel. Yes, they do have some things they need to rectify. Just like the United States, just like any democracy. You've got all the answers there, boss. If, when I said, what do they do over here in Gaza? What do they do? I have no idea. I'm just a comedian. Don't listen to me. So which one is it? You either know your shit or you're actually... Just so what was your question? What's the solution so for what's Israel? The solution? I said, Israel for Gaza. Back the land. For Gaza, how yeah. about you stop the killing and then we can okay, talk? Okay, so let's say we do that. Okay. So I, I, here's what I believe. I, need, I think we need to demilita demilitarize Gaza. We need to de-radicalize because they're the leading. How are you going to de-radicalize? De how do you do well, that? Well, maybe let's stop. So how about let's stop summer schools the, where they teach about okay. jihad how, and they start playing football okay, and how, soccer. How about the religious schools okay. in Israel that actually tell people that we should kill all Arabs? And these well, videos you, are you, you know all those idea. Jews that are running around bombing everywhere around the yeah. world? No, it doesn't fucking exist. Oh, it's really? only in Islam. Oh, really? What about the Jews killing the Palestinians <laughs> inside? I'm talking about the around the world. If oh, I said there was we're, a, we're bad people. Oh, we're bad people. Take us out. I'm sorry, but he doesn't give a. He literally does not give a fuck.
doesn't. He don't. Yeah, his, his, I'm gonna be 100. His does seem a little, uh, he has a bias. Oh, for sure. Oh, what about for, for sure? He's like, they both have biases. No, like, definitely. Yeah. But definitely. But like, but the, dude like with the, the dude with the data is being like so relentless. Like, he's like not hearing anything he's saying. He's not. He's like yeah. refu refuting everything he's saying. Like, he just doesn't. It's, it's like he literally has his mind made up. Everything yeah, he does, yeah. that bro has to say is, is, I, is. I wish we could hear the, you know, the dude in the middle. Oh, who, Patrick I, I wish he, I want to hear what he has to say. He, he, he said, spoke on it on the podcast for sure before. I, I, he's I, would, I, I, would, I would honestly like yeah. to hear his But it is, it's, it's so, it's such a, yeah, and people are very passionate on both sides. That's why I'm surprised so that's he why doesn't when, give a fuck. When, when both sides argue, nobody's going to be like, okay, you're right. That I've seen so far. Not nah, facts. Like, it's like whatever argument they go in with, that's the argument they're coming out with. I just wonder what's the most humane way for everybody to have equal respect that's, for each other. 24,000 people dead, 60,000 people injured, about 10,000 dead are children under 18. 8,000 or more are missing. Damn, that's crazy. I understand yeah. that what happened on October 7th was extremely bad, but like they're still dropping bombs to this day. It's January the 14th. Yeah, that is crazy. But the fact that they're still dropping bombs is crazy. Like, at least, like. I thought they killed the, the leader. I have no idea what they did, bro. I don't know. I know they're on foot in there, though. Are they actually? Yes. You know, oh, wow. So they. It just. Y'all want to know? I don't know what to do. I don't know. I don't that's why I, I have no idea. I, I, I would never that's be, why I got tired of talking about it. We come in peace, man. There's no, yeah. There's yeah, no, there's no right answer. We just want peace. So it's tunnels. In so they went in the tunnels. They're everywhere. I don't know. Israel what soldiers are everywhere. Well, they got tunnels everywhere, apparently, and around the world. Everybody got a tunnel. Don't talk so. about it. We don't talk about it. I'm just surprised this guy is just going so hard like this, though. He's going very hard. He looks like JJ Reddick, though. So what was your question? What's the solution so for what's Israel? The solution? I said Israel for Gaza. Back the land. For Gaza, how yeah. about you stop the killing and then we can okay, talk? Okay, so let's say we do that. Okay. So I, I, here's what I believe. I, need, I think we need to demilitarize, demilitarize Gaza. We need to de-radicalize because they're the leading. How are you going to de-radicalize? De how do you do well, that? Well, let maybe let's stop. So how about let's stop summer schools the, where they teach about okay. jihad ha, ha, and they start playing football okay, and how, soccer. How about the religious schools okay. in Israel that actually tell people that we should kill all Arabs? And these well, videos you, are you, you know all those idea. Jews that are running around bombing everywhere around the yeah. world? No, it doesn't fucking exist. Oh, it's really? only in Islam. Oh, really? But what about the Jews killing the Palestinians wild, inside? I'm talking about the around the world. If oh, I said there was we're, a, we're bad people. Oh, we're bad people. No, Take us out. That's not what I'm saying. No, no, no. We're very. Okay, what I'm saying. We is are they a need terrorist to, they, religion. We are a terrorist oh. religion. Take it out. You said it. Your Let's words. do it. You yeah. said it. Let's your words. Words. Was his words. You just said it. Like, what the fuck? What no, he just yeah, said. You can't say to uh, everybody. You can't say they're all. That's wrong. I, I, you can't generalize. Honestly, honestly, all honestly people he said. And say they're no, all he wrong. said that's only in Islam, and then he started. Being I don't sarcastic. know. I don't know the, the sarcastic yeah. and applying his logic to like the religion, and now yeah, he's he he's trying to he's it. trying to deflect. Yeah. Well, you, you just said it. it. You just said it. Yeah. yeah. If he's looking at it. You can't he's say that whole religion is one way or a whole group of people is one way. Period. At all. He's people. People are people that follow a religious are not a monolith and. People who Hopefully he's are not monolithic. Content. Hope he doesn't really. So they're like not going to be the same. When, until we start having deep conversations, we start getting a little bit more. You know. Yeah, understand. we was going into this topic a lot. Even so off we had guys. to just do more like because a lot of things I said in the original videos. You know, I was wrong too, but I just got passionate. You know, it's a very passionate thing on both sides. So that's why now I'm trying to look at it from as much both sides as possible, and I'm trying to not you know put emotions into it. And I'm trying to just think really, really think about it, and I know it's just up all the way around and I don't know the solution but I do know you can't either side you can't say all Jews are this way all of Israel is this way can't you can't say all Palestinians or all Muslims are this way that is a big problem in America too because people say all white people are this way or all black people yeah, are you this can't, way you can't, you can't speak Christians of people way, as like monolithic all, all of one people are not one way in Facts. any group of people in Facts. Every, anywhere around Facts. the world so you gotta judge each person based on who they are Facts. and that's 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 a thing the biggest issue everybody in the world on all sides does Thanks. But you don't think a little bit of stereotype is tap bit. Even True. if they can't be just well, because of that, I, though, I believe you can't, you can't are, are hold that against someone, though. No. Yeah, because like black people do bad things, but they can't hold that against all of us. They can't, and it's a true stereotype. Yeah, there's a lot of stereotype. I believe the the root cause of stereotypes are from some event. So I mean, they all. So have, that's why you can't. They all have yeah, some you truth can't to hold them. a stereotype over nobody. But it's you can't. You can't speak of people like and in, in the terms of like monolith monolithic speak because no nobody not all people are the same. Like 
we're all black guys here and we all are different. Like we all think different, act different, behave different. That's just an example. I just can't believe he just shitted on the religion though. That's the craziest part. No, that was crazy. He's insane. Then he tried to say, you said it, not me. It's only in Islam. Oh really? But what about the Jews killing the Palestinians inside? I'm talking about the round the world. If I said there was a- We're bad people. Are we bad people? Take us out. That's not what I'm saying. No, 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 we're very- What I'm saying is they need to- We are a terrorist religion. We are a terrorist religion. Take it out. You said it. Your Let's words. Let's do it. You yeah. said it. Let's your do words. It. Yeah. Your words. Let's do it. I mean, like your words. This is, this is like you have. A, it. You have a really interesting outlook for people who look like me. You look at me and I'm Muslim, and you you have all of these assumptions about me being a terrorist. While Islam not is at not all. a terrorist. You, you know said the words. You know I didn't say the words. You know words. what's the difference between you Islam said the and words. terrorists? They go on on like some rogue groups and they kill and they do shitty stuff. But you have like a whole country with a whole military arsenal who is committing. Terrorism every single day back to the There it is. US. There's your Israel talking. Yeah, yeah, Israel yeah. I'm going to talk it. I'm th that's my that's, opinion. That's my opinion. Totally that's cool. That's my opinion. Totally cool. Yeah. It's all good. But you're trying to tell me that Islam doesn't have a terrorist problem? Islam, Muslims have a terrorist problem. Correct. It's like when you say Islam has a Muslim problem, when you say Judaism has a Muslim problem. <laughs> All right. A lot of Muslims are assholes and so, they're doing sh horrible stuff. And I, I do not feel the need to defend those people because those people don't represent me. The thing is, if people Jews were running thing, around all over the world, blowing themselves up as suicide bombers, as a Jew, I'd be like, guys, what the fuck are we doing here? What are okay. we doing here? Okay. This is accomplishing nothing. So let's but here's the, the so let's But here's the, the reality. Let's Jews the aren't doing that. And Christians Jews are aren't not. doing that. Jews are not. Let me ask you a They're question. They're not doing that in Gaza. They're not doing that in the West Bank. Everything you talk about is Gaza. I'm talking yeah, about the world. Yeah, because that's what's happening You're right now. so obsessed with this one topic. I am. I'm trying because to understand the world. Because my family lives there. Okay. Because my, fa my family lives there. But my family's in Israel. Really? So only your family counts? My family doesn't no, count? No, no, no. Okay, but like, did your family are living in an open air prison and being killed every day? The open air prison, the genocide. Get them. You see how you're making fun of me? Everybody. Israel, only talking Israel left it's Gaza only in 2006. It didn't leave. It okay. left and it put it under blockade. It's called a disengagement. It, it, no. Disengagement. Why disengagement. do they have a blockade? Maybe because they're shooting missiles hundreds of times a day. Yeah, I'd pretty much put a yeah. country in a you, blockade you, if they were cut, shooting you, missiles every single day. You cut, you cut them from the air, day. cut them from the sea, cut them from the water. It's so like, okay, go live. How Let, do you do that? Let's move on from Israel because I know you're hyper obsessed with it. Why? I'm not hyper obsessed. You keep asking me about Israel. No, I ask you about the world. And I'm asking you about Christianity and Muslims and Judaism. You want to focus on Israel. Why? can Muslims move to any Christian country they want, but Christians and Jews can move to zero Muslim countries. Why is that? Hmm? What about Dubai? What about I'll Saudi ask it Arabia? again. What about all of these countries? What, what are you talking you, about? You mean the You're just mentioning Qatar and Dubai and all of there's like a lot of expats living you, there. So the middle, th this is my point, and I'm glad you're catching on. Yeah. That I'm not racist. I'm, I'm pointing out. Well, there are Christian countries who like, like shit, I wouldn't lose no, that I, because of the economy. I, I'm pointing out that in certain Muslim countries, they're getting it right, or at okay. least attempting to. Good for them. Okay? Yeah. Yes, good for them. Mm -hmm. Good for Qatar. Good for UAE. Good for Saudi and what MBS is doing. Good for them. They're examples of what could be done. Gaza, if they took the billions of government of, of international aid, could be Dubai, but they decided to make a terror state. So the question that I'm where, asking where does, is- what, what, you, Are you saying that like, there's so many money coming in and just like Hamas used it in order to make weapons? There's people of Hamas who are literal billionaires living in Qatar, flying around on private yeah, yeah. jets. They're, they're, How do you explain they're that? They're horrible people and I don't condone them. All right, okay. oh. I'm talking about the millions of people. Yeah, we but, yeah, oh, horrible people, Hamas. Let's not talk, talk about that, we'll move on. But Israel. Oh, let's let me let me let me, let me give you a Gaza. dissertation Dude, over here. Like, you you you. But, but, I'm, I'm trying bad. to give you just like shouting over me. I'm not because yeah, every time I'm okay, talking, you, you are basically you talk. going around all of the stuff that's happening with Muslim uh, people that is bad. And then you, uh, base what you're doing is you are undertoning. You are trying to find an excuse to keep that killing in Gaza continue I'm, because because Muslims are bad. Muslims are terrorists. Muslims are poor. So let's just like kill those people in Gaza. You are this is exactly so what you're doing. intellectually it's lazy. Going. It's com it's comical. That's basically because I'm not even talking you, about you, you, Gaza. You keep insulting me. We're, not, you we're keep insulting wrap me. Up. Because we're I'm because trying. Because she's like, you are, a, you are a motherfucking racist. You know, like, you, how would you What have I, if said I said that's that? racist? I'm saying Everything that there's. Everything that you say about racists is the way that you speak about Muslims, that we are terrorists and we are horrible people. Basically, you're telling people that we deserve to, to die. Basta and Israel said, has everything uh, to do in order to kill those people. That's, I've, so, anyways, I, if I've if, said if, zero hope, of those words. Hopefully, if you are putting all those words in my mouth, I said zero of those words. If my cousin who's a doctor get killed tomorrow, I'm gonna okay. send you a postcard. So if my actual cousin Damn. gets killed in Israel, they that's okay. Not, they will not because okay. you know what? They are safe because he is not living in an open air oh, prison. Oh, wh why are they safe? Maybe because they have the Israeli Defense Force, the yeah. Iron Dome that Good stops for you. Good for you. all the missiles. They don't have that. Yeah, but they don't have that. Maybe you should have built that instead of oh, tunnels. With what? That's with crazy. all the billions.
billions of foreign aid that was given? Foreign, yes. What billion foreign That's aid crazy. are you? These, these, how much money does Iran bill- give? How much money does Qatar all, give? How much does the international money community? Is actually trickled through Israel. You understand that Israel is actually your, holding your that Your argument money holds from, no weight because all you're doing you, is defending you Hamas. Under, you have not, zero I'm argument. I'm the last one to defend Hamas, by the way. Never once defended Hamas. And I don't be, and I'm a big fan of Hamas. But I'm just giving you some facts. Every single money that goes into Gaza goes through Israel. As a matter of fact, Biden has a big problem with Netanyahu because he's withholding the tax money that paid by the Palestinian people to the Palestinian Authority, and Netanyahu is holding it back. You're Have you heard about that? Have you read about that? Just two days ago, if you're reading your stuff, but you don't. But the thing is, Netanyahu is holding back the tax money from the Palestinian in West Bank, and he's not giving it to you're so funny, man. Damn. You're so funny. No, you're, 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 you're just saying, all, crazy. All, you're saying, you're saying you're all ignorant. the money yeah. that's going to Hamas is coming through Israel? Sure. Filtered through sure. Israel. Sure. sure. All Filtered the money. through Israel. Yeah, all the money from Iran going right through Israel. Sure, that's how likely. About, how, all the money from Qatar. How about you read the transcript by Netanyahu okay. in 2019, the Likud okay. party, telling them that he they is actually over, facts. Over, over <laughs> the facts the amount them. of money coming from Qatar, and, and he is doing that in order to split the, the Palestinian Authority. Listen to I'm me. I'm familiar with how, this. How, I'm not disagreeing how, how with... About I, you, how about you not, you listen, educate yourself I'm about not, that. I'm not disagreeing that Netanyahu has done some fucked up oh, things. Oh, here it is. Okay. Here it is. Oh, my God. Here it is. Biden is in frustrating call told Bibi to solve Palestinian tax revenue issue. Yeah, because issue? Israel is withholding that's, the taxes. You understand every single money that's transaction. That's your argument right there? Every, no, that's not part of the argument. Why is every, he, why that's bro, a huge argument. That's what I'm saying. Why does bro with the, with the suit, he's getting cooked uh, in my opinion. Like, uh, he came with the, with some facts, with some with some facts, but then bro tried to explain the facts and he was like, no, that's not true. You have no way to prove that. You have no way to prove that. You have no way to prove that. How control bro. Israel has over Palestine. I don't think he understands it, bro. I don't think he cares, honestly. I don't like, think he cares. I just think he just... I don't, I don't know, bro. I just think he wants to be right so bad. Like, he's, like, literally trying to argue with everything bro saying. And, like, then he said, you're just trying to uh, support Hamas when he never once said anything about Hamas once. Low and then key. he said, then he said, I have no reason to, like, even defend those people because they don't represent me. So, there's no reason for me to even address that. Now, oh, you're defending Hamas. Why does everyone always say, well, if you don't support Israel, you support Hamas. Okay. Damn. So, this look like... That's such a tired argument. This is actually insane because the argument that people are saying, well, Palestine and Gaza should have did better with the money. It is going through Israel's hands first. They have control over Palestine. I don't think people understand how much control they have over Palestine. So, so, Would that not piss you I, off as a country? I was going to ask probably a dumb question. I don't know if I'm wrong or right for asking this. So if it's going to the Palestinian people, will Israel is supposed to give it to the Palestinian people? Do that mean Hamas is touching that money? No, they are holding the money. Well, I, but see, see, we, we don't, don't know, know because we don't know. We, there's the billionaires. Yeah, we don't yeah, know. That's, that's why I messed up about so that. They, they, so, so they, how, they hold some money too. So that's why I said they're like, like, sold out or how something. How do they get that money to Gaza? Is the question so I would like to know. About we don't yeah. know. How does that money even one. get there? That's a huge question. Like, that's a big question. There's a lot of details that we don't know. Yeah, no, people keep saying that. And it's like, okay, like, that is a problem. But, like, if, if Gaza is such like so like blockaded and they can't get anything, how do they even get the money in? Once they get the money, how are they gonna get weapons and stuff with said money? Well, they get that shit through the tunnels. They get that shit through the tunnels. So low key, we don't know what but situation it they're in. It like. I, 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 I just seeing, got a lot of questions. I got a lot of questions. Lot of questions. That's a fair question. <laughs> That's, a great question. Question. That's a great question. It's kind of like what he said. But is so Israel would be given like if they know Hamas is gonna bomb them, would they give Hamas the money? That's why I'm trying. That's what I'm confused about. <sighs> If they said they're holding their money, that's why I don't. I don't know. I'm not saying it's true. Well, I mean, I'm saying I don't. That's it, a fair. It, it, that's a great you. question because if that's what the reason, their uh, explanation for withholding said money is, I mean, I guess I mean. That's but you know, I just don't but, know. but but what was the other but, country that were giving them? There's West Bank though. Like, what about them in West Bank? There's but, no Hamas in West Bank. But, no terrorists in West Bank. So but, okay. Like so, they then they live super poor over there too. So if that money is supposed to be trickled between Gaza and West Bank, then. I don't think you can really what justify that. What was that country that, that was that. giving them weapons? What was that called again? Iran? Iran. Maybe Iran's giving them the money, man. They are giving them money. They that's that's a fact. They said that. This that like, debunks a lot of shit right there. I, I'm messed up about but this, bro. I don't know. I don't know. And like, this... it, 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 but that's the thing though. He also is making all of those people, he's putting them all in the same like boat because it's bad people in Christianity. He said, they're not doing this in Christianity? They're not doing, it's yeah, bad people in Christianity. Bad people, yeah. Christianity. There's been a lot of, there's been a lot there's of things. There's people that take everything. money from in churches everything. that is a There's been a lot of bad things yeah. committed in the name of Christianity. So there's bad things in every religion. Yeah, so no, he facts. can't, he can't been, say that. There's, there's been good, bad man. acts committed in every religion. There's been bad apples. That's what, it just goes back to the same thing we ever say. Every yeah. group of people, you got good and bad apples. Every single one. Every single one. And we don't know the situation. Think about if you're a leader over 
over there. You just got a billion dollars. I mean, you do want to help your people, but then you might think, um, I don't know if this is going to help them. <laughs> they both. That could be it. Yeah, like, a lot of we boss leaders have all that money and it's just multiple, travel they, they, yeah. It's multiple. They're, they're traveling around freely that, in other that, that, countries. That, yeah. that sounds like they they're they selling out their life. people to it could be. be. It could be that, yeah. though. We don't know what it technically That's, is. I don't know. With, we don't know. I don't know, but that sounds weird to me. One hundred percent. It is. It One hundred thousand. It is. It's a lot of weird, but like political things that's going on. But that's everything. Everybody's agreeing on that these kids should stop dying. And innocent people should stop dying. That's everybody's problem, really. Politics is evil, man. Nah, this is insane. In order to split the the Palestinian Authority. Listen to I'm me. I'm familiar with this. How, how, I'm not disagreeing how, how with. About I, you, how about you? How about you? Listen. Educate yourself I'm about not, that. I'm not disagreeing that Netanyahu has done some fucked up oh, things. Oh, here it is. Okay. Here it is. <laughs> oh my God! Here it is. It's Biden is in frustrating call told Bibi to solve Palestinian tax revenue issue. Yeah, because issue? Israel is withholding that's, the taxes. You understand every single money that's transaction. That's your argument right there. That's every, a big no, argument. That's part of the argument. Every single money transaction, whether it's taxes, whether it's aids, yeah. it has to go through the Israeli government. So all the money that Iran is funding Hamas, you're saying that goes through Israel? Oh, is sure. that what you're saying? Through Qatar, through Israel. Okay, that's oh. so false. It's so flagrantly false. I, I want you to educate what? yourself more. Okay, I will. I'll go read up on this. But if you mean to tell me that Israel is intercepting accepting the money that Iran is sending to Hamas and says, yeah, we'll send it to you guys. But, but, Believe me, they're not doing it. By the way, it's 11.15. It's 11.15. We're going to wrap up. It was, yeah. interesting to, it was interesting to hear um, uh, off the rip when he had the facts. I was interested to hear what Bassam's rebuttal would be. But then when he started explaining, well, like, they got moved in there. And then Brody was like, no, you have no way to prove that. I'm like, well, damn, he just said his people, people from there. there. Like, he just said his people live there. Like, is that not enough? But I don't know. I just think Buddy with the suit on and the t-shirt top with the suit You think he's been sarcastic when he said his, uh, he has family in Israel? You think he was serious? No, his wife is he from said, there. He, he, he said that. He said that No, I'm talking times. about no, no, no. He said he's Jewish. Oh, oh, dude. I don't know. Bro he said, said he his family, family there. Uh, I mean, I don't I don't doubt it. I mean... I was trying to figure out his name, bro. Because, you know, all, all, I'm pretty sure... No, I won't say this. But <laughs> yeah, I did see somewhere where all people who are Jewish get automatic citizenship to Israel. So I mean, if, oh yeah, yeah, that's a fact. That's a fact. That's a fact. And if he's but, Jewish, that's, that's a fact. It's very, that's, very, that's like it's how very, I get into Ghana, though, by birth. No, yeah, that's like, actually I a fact. Born there. No, it's by religion. They get citizenship. No, yeah, yeah. If you're so, Jewish, if you, you say get you're Jewish right now, you get citizenship, buddy. Oh, damn. That's why that's I said. I know. I've been seeing a lot of stuff on Instagram, man. Mm -hmm. I mean, I've seen a Jewish guy walking to a Palestinian uh, lady home and said, "This is mine now." I did see that. Yeah, no. So I've seen a lot of stuff, but I mean, it was it was a very interesting debate. Seen that, brother? It was a very interesting debate. I really think Buddy with the suit jacket on wasn't really trying to argue, though, because he did keep insulting, bro, and he didn't get hit. And Bassam didn't really insult him once, but he did start getting hot. He it's did. very, very heated. No, it's, it's, very it's heated. a very heated argument. Very heated That's exchange. why I like us. We have had this argument off camera for probably hours. I would like y'all have not seen. I would, not probably I would, literally. I would like hours. to see what uh, the comments are saying. So we oh, not the comments, gonna, you know, comments. We choosing cooking. peace on the Cartier yeah, family we're trying side to choose from peace. now on. Yeah, we have left. We have this we've, room, not this room. The house just heated, guys. Yeah, I had to go for a drive to calm down. But Simo. They said, uh, because Adam is a crock of stupid. Is mm. that who that guy was? Yeah. Adam. Adam so he did sound pretty ignorant. I can't lie. There's nothing more dangerous than a person who thinks he's smarter than he is. Yeah, bro thought he was a genius. Yeah. <laughs> the fact he got too emotional. that a man like Adam with such limited intellect can come this far in life is actually quite inspiring. <laughs> we can all make it, guys. Congrats, Bassam, for generally keeping his cool and delivering his message in the face of constant provocations insults and interruptions from someone with a clear agenda of upholding the mainstream media narrative. Wow. Well, yeah, I just feel like it's just a lot of opinions out there without actually being in the situation and actually knowing what's going on in the actual facts. Yeah, I'm not gonna yeah. lie. Buddy came with like this little printed off Google sheet and after he read that off, I'm pretty sure his mind was made yeah, up. He but he said, oh, I'm gonna kick Basim. Yeah. Basim. He Basim even, how you say Basim or Basim? Basim. I yeah, believe it's Basim. Basim. I think both shit. people like... And he cooked that argument. When you come in an argument like that, especially if it's so personal, no matter what, you're gonna stand on... What you, what you believe, what you're yeah. yeah, both sides, yeah. yeah, that's true. If you're a Jewish person, you're gonna rock with, and if you're Hustlin, you're probably gonna, you know, no, facts, it's facts. Like, it's very like, much I facts. I feel like no matter what, arguing about it isn't gonna help, but talking about it, like you're saying, I guess it's educational, but at the same time, that last talking point, I would say, don't, don't end no uh friendships over this, shit. oh, yeah, it, yeah, it was yeah, interesting. I didn't like, I didn't like his comments about how he tried to like throw Islam under the bus, though. That was, that oh, was, yeah, that, that was absolutely cool. terrible. That was kind of disrespectful. That was, yeah, you can't, yeah, that was extreme yeah. you because you know, he doesn't know what those people go through, you know? That's why it's like fucked up. It's, it's wrong what they're doing. I can't, but, I can't, I can't. Bassam said it's wrong. 
wrong. I can't, we don't know what I can't justify terrorism, but to you just can't. say that, oh, your religion has a terrorist problem, that's kind of crazy. Like, yeah, that's definitely hilarious. That's like us seeing some people walking on the street and, you know, that's, that's like uh, saying Catholics. They read the Quran and said they'll just blow everything that's up. That's the problem we have in America because some people say Christianity right now because of the KKK and stuff. Yeah, people do, yeah. Does the KKK so, even exist do in 2024? Yeah, yeah, they do. Uh, on the low. Probably, they yeah, do. probably on some. We were just seeing no, the video. But that um, last talking point was yeah. huge because Biden, remember, he came out in um, South point, Carolina man. and they were like, you know, you know people like shouted at him about, you know, the uh, free fire, not the free fire, the, um, what is it called? Ceasefire. Um, ceasefire on that. Biden was like, uh, yeah, we're going to try to fix that. Biden mm -hmm. is controlling all that shit. Well, I don't know if he's controlling Brother, it, but I think he definitely, he lit the flame, I think he has a hand in it. And... He knows that the money that they're trying to send to them is going through Israel. That's a way to stop that shit. Don't we don't know. know where. Technically, we don't know if they're getting that money. I can't come out and say that. We don't. That's what I'm saying. We don't know if they're getting that money. I can't come out and say that. We don't know nothing, certain. bro. Yeah, we know nothing. We don't know anything at all. Well, we they pray. pulled it up though, we but we don't know if that was true. You we know, pray for peace in the Middle East. Yeah, guys, let's know what y'all think. Pray about for peace. Period. Yeah, guys, in this world, we come in peace. We're gonna.